Uh, I'm Elisa. Maggie. Right. I'm Dorka. Okay, where are you guys from? Estonia. Poland. Hungary. <laughs> okay, and you're playing for what team? Wyoming tennis team. You played juniors and all that stuff growing up? Uh, yeah, um, I got started when I was like seven years old and played um, like little mini tournaments, I guess, and then went to a sports high school right. and kept playing until college. You're from Estonia. Estonia. Okay, gotcha. And you, uh, what do you get a scholarship at Wyoming? Is that yes. what it is? Mm -hmm. Okay, and you went to a high school, uh, sports high school? Yeah. What's that mean? Uh, so it's basically like college. We start with practice, then we have classes all day, and then we finish with practice. So it's like an American academy. Basically, yeah. Gotcha. But but I went to high school at home, Estonia. So. Okay. Okay. So then you played all and you played like na uh, international matches yeah, and all that stuff. Yeah, internationals, uh, tennis, Europe tournaments, and like. Okay, and you guys are the same. How about you? Yes. What's what country again? Poland. Okay. Um, I started when I was six. Right. Uh, I also went to. It was actually tennis academy. Right. I played Hungarian juniors, then uh, tennis Europe, and then finished with ITF tournaments. All three of you played ITF. Yes. And what was your highest rankings like? Uh, mine was around two fifty. Okay. Yeah. And mine was like three hundred. Three hundred. I was top seven hundred. I think they downgrade college tennis. Right. A lot of people think it's just kind of like a. I don't know. It, it's an easier it's thing than. It's an easier than way to still continue tennis and get like free education. Yeah. Right. But it's not. I, there are some pretty good players here in college. How many people are American born that are on your team? One. Okay. One <laughs> when I was 16, I almost quit. Because? Because I was not as successful as I wanted to be, and it was hard, and I was a teenager, so right. I definitely had that had those moments. But I'm glad I didn't. And was there like a match where you like broke all your rackets and? No, I off? never do that. It wasn't one I, of those. No, okay. I'm not one of those people. No. So what happened? Um, I. It wasn't. Cry. <laughs> <laughs> not, I'm not proud of it, but. Yeah. Okay. Elisa is our King Kong on the team. Okay. Hitting a volley right. from like close to the net, and I guess I missed it. Coach is exaggerating, but the ball, ball might the ball still be flying. Still <laughs> huh? The ball hit the court, but it's still going up. But yeah, it's it's still going somewhere, so the right. ball is still flying. So, what is your story to get them going? To get them going? Well, they're college athletes. They should get themselves going. Right. You know, so if they don't get going, usually I kind of use like the cattle prog method. So. Which cool. means run. Yeah, kind of. Okay. So, I was the only American on my team, the only English speaker. Which was what team where? In Labar University. It's okay. A division, small division one in Texas. Okay. And so, I used to uh, get mad at the South Americans because they listened to terrible music. They were just weird. I thought they were lazy. But after about a year of being there, I figured out, okay, they're just different. For me, they're weird, but I guess I'm weird for them. And so, that kind of helped me to be a little more open-minded. So, I'm hoping that they learn and four years here to be more open-minded. Because you must tell each other on the bus. There's not something. Uh, like th those are mostly like oh, awkward we girl bus. jokes. <laughs> <laughs> or whatever you take. the car. Okay, in the car. In the car. So what's the joke? So name one that you told to each other. We just, because um, there are so many different countries, we like um, say funny expressions in other languages. That's our joke sometimes and to get us going. And like for example? There, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, no. Not appropriate it's not for public. But yeah, okay. that's like, yeah. Actually, that's we do that a lot. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. like, our American girl knows um, words in Estonian, mm -hmm. Polish, Hungarian, and we all kind of know. Yeah. Okay. And then, like, when we go to tournaments, there's like other people from those countries as well, and then we kind of like whisper those same, like, kind of maybe expressions, but it's, yeah. yeah but that's, it's that's not our part of the house. <laughs>